Damas y caballeros, aquí tenemos presente al que más ha defendido su título en la UFC. I'm glad a Demetrius Mighty Mouse Johnson. Hey. Mighty Mouse was looking at Lechero like, huh? What? What? I just said every word he said. Don't worry about it. Is that right? Wow. He said, I'm gorgeous. Look at my skin. It's perfect. <laughs> yes. it's exactly. I wish exactly I had that said. frame and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome. He said, he's, he said, you're huge in the pants. Everything. I mean, it's just insane, man. Uh, Mighty Mouse is here. He did not say that. Pause. Uh, you brought the belt. The belt. The belt is here. Make sure the camera gets the belt. This is amazing. Are you going to Walmart with this belt? Uh, no, hell no. The belt no. goes everywhere you go? What are we doing? <laughs> no, just, just in L.A. It ain't going to Walmart. I'm, I really go to Walmart. Walmart's got some good prices, though, but no Walmart. <laughs> right, no. Roll back. Right, right, right. You're fiscally yeah. responsible, right? Absolutely. My man. Uh, two kids? Two kids. Any more kids? Maybe one more. We'll see what happens. One more. Aww. When they want to fight, are you okay with that? No. You know, you, you, you They're going to want to do what daddy did. That's true, but you hear NFL players all the time. I play football so my kids don't have to play football, right? Got it. You, and that's the same way for me. I fight so my kids don't have to fight. I like that. Um, obviously, if things change in, you know, mixed martial arts world where the money's a lot better, then I'll, I'll make it happen. But I don't want them to have to go through the things I went through. Sure. What did you go through? You know, just all the bullshit. Obviously, you know, I, I've, I've defended about 11 consecutive times. Um, yeah. You know, I, I put a lot of hard work into this sport. Mm -hmm. Um, and I'm, I'm still not at the point where I can retire yet, you know. So you think about it, if, if you know, Tom Brady or any other NFL player yeah. won five Super Bowls, they should be able to retire. Sure. Mm -hmm. uh, and that's not the case in mixed martial arts. Uh, not to say that it needs to be, but I don't want my kids have to go in there, have to be popular, and also they might not be popular. They might be like just some badasses like me. <laughs> and, right. Right. You know. So we'll see what happens. Do they know about you growing up? Will they know about you growing up? And yeah. The things you had to do. And yeah, of course. Yeah, I, 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 Certain I, positions you had to fight your way out of. Yeah, I'll tell them all that stuff. And, I mean, they already know I fight. Like, when I came home, my, my oldest goes, Dad, you won your fight. Give me a high five. And I'm oh. like, sounds good. He Amazing. goes, Amazing. Good job. And I was like, thanks, man. And every time I come, I come home, you know, I come and goes, hey, what's up, Mommy and Daddy? And I'm like, just chilling, dog, just chilling. So I talked to him like, He's my best friend. That's dope. Aww, That's cool, man. Five. That's cool, man. Congratulations. That's Thank awesome. You. Congratulations uh, to you. You uh, have eight month old. Eight month old, eleven teeth. He's growing. I mean, the the, the guy's got a little mustache. He's got a job. He starts yeah, right. next Wednesday. <laughs> yeah, no, right. He's very excited about it. It's amazing. But yeah, we're also talking about having another as oh, well. Good for you. But the baby is sleeping in between us. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So that could be an issue. You ever go through that? Uh, I did. See, that's where you get hit up with the quickies. You usually have like, hey, just it's what yeah. we got. It's how we got. How'd you deal with the poop on you and all that? What are you gonna oh, do, right? Poop is poop. Poop is poop. Poop, poop is poop. poop. Is poop. I think that's a t-shirt at poop best. Is poop. Poop, poop is poop. Is poop. Yeah. <laughs> How are you as a family guy? Are you are you insensitive? Uh, do you have a temper because of what you do? Are you uh would you say you're a good father, yeah, a good I, husband? I mean, I, I I would like to say I'm a good husband. Sure. Um, I, I like to say I'm a, a good father. I do have a temper, but I've never laid a single finger on my kids. Never have. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, I, I that's one will. thing I don't want to do. I don't want to spank my kids, man. Yeah. But um, you know, my parents did, and I learned a lot from it. Yeah, absolutely. I, I, I mean, same here, I got you know. My ass whooped. Ditto. <laughs> like, and, and it still is fear in them, but there's other ways you can go about instilling fear in them. Yeah. Um, but other than that, I mean, that's where my temper gets tested is with the kids. I'm like, yeah. there's nothing that drives me at the woman. I said, hey, sit down, please eat your food. Sure. When I say, right. Say it nicely, and I say it please. I expect it to happen immediately. No reward system. No reward system. Uh, you know, I'm a, I, I am a briber. I'm like, hey, yeah. dog, hey, you want your, you know, your tablet? You want your fire? Sit down, eat all this food. Yeah. Okay, thanks, Dad. Give me fire. Boom, boom. Yeah. But I was like, now it could happen. Wait, is the yeah. iPad babysitting them? No, no, no. Only so I give them the the tablet after the end of the day so they'll go to school sure. they'll have their social interaction they'll play outside they'll look for bugs yeah. I'll spend time with them play Monster Jam they're, they're, everything's been met in my criteria for them to have the tablet but they don't just wake up and get the fire or the tablet immediately yeah. no they gotta be mentally challenged that day Garcia are you bribing the boys at all? Oh yeah, that's part of parenting, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. But yeah, but, yeah he can't. I can't. Get them to go to school. <laughs> exactly, yeah. man. Um, when they're older, they'll the, the bribes will have to stop though because yeah. they, they expect something for everything. Not when they're eleven, you shouldn't have to bribe them to clean up the dog poop in the front yard. They should no. just be doing it. So right. you have to cut that off. But his point about the uh, the the pad, the iPads, and all that stuff, you can't control that enough. You have to, man, because if not, bro, the, you will be invisible to them once they put that in front of their face. Yeah, yeah. you can't. Like I can't tell you enough. You yeah. can't get them to eat or focus or, or yeah. speak to other human beings. You yep. know what I mean? Yeah. So that's always I'll, I'll always wait to the end of the day. Like they'll go outside yeah. play with their friends, do all this stuff. But then when I need to get stuff done that's critical, I'm like. 
here's the fires, do your thing, yep. and let me know. And then they, they're they still good. Sometimes I love it, like, when I watch a fight, I'm like, I'm bored. And I'll throw the fire in, and then they'll, they'll go start doing other stuff. Sure. I'm like, I'm all done, Dad, thanks, and then they'll go off. Oh, and they cool. actually learn from that stuff, too. So yeah. Sure, sure, yeah. It could be educational, right? Yep. Uh, is your wife asking when are you going to retire? No, 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 no absolutely not. No, she, 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 I mean, there was one time where she goes, if you want to retire now, you can go ahead and retire. Just because I was going through some, some, I was just like second guess and stuff. And I was like, you oh, know. That sucks. I hate that. Overthinking. Was that it? I wasn't overthinking. It was just like, I'm just tired of like going through this. Yeah. Um, and then she goes, just retire. Who cares? Let's, I'll go get a job and you get a job and make it into me. And I was like, wow. Yeah. But at the same time, but so she's all in it for, she she's loves a real it. one. Huh? She's a real one. Yeah. She, I mean, she don't care. She's been with me since my second amateur fight. So. We we've been together when we had a, a queen size bed, <laughs> a desk, and three DD, DVDs. Sin City, right. waiting, right. waiting. I can't remember the other one. <laughs> waiting is clapping. <laughs> <laughs> yep, 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 yep. <laughs> yep, absolutely. And so, but now everything is good. She's been with you from day one. Yep, it's very important. Yeah, absolutely, one hundred percent. Yeah, man. And this is a victory tour. Yeah, Victor Tour. We are here. Congratulations, Mike. Yeah. Congratulations. Come on, man. Give it up, man. <laughs> you, listen, I want to thank you, Mighty Mouse. You've been on the show numerous times. You've called us. You've been here. We always appreciate your time. You're always up here. Thank you very much. Of for course, that, of course. Dog. Thanks for having me. I appreciate Why do you it. come up here? It's okay. It's just nice. It's just I come. Right, I come right. to see this girl right here. That's <laughs> like, uh-huh. yeah. I knew it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. Shout out to your wife. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> yeah, no, right. I'm taking you in. No, no, no. It, it's, it, it's Crystal's always... good for that, by the way. <laughs> Crystal's so good for that. that man. When I saw my camera, she had a black guy, and I was like, "Ooh, what is going on? Oh, another one, huh? Another no. one." Right. It was from snowboarding. Oh, that's right. That's, that's right. right. That's right. That's right. back there holding his hand. Let's tell what's up. So, eleven times you've defended your title. Out of those eleven times, which was the most difficult? Most difficult? Yeah. I see all of them, man. I mean, every single it's gotta fight. Be one, bro. No, I mean, they're not because every single person I look at, they always bring something different. Whether it's me, cry- I'm I'm very tactical and I'm very critical about yep. certain things. So when it comes to crossing distance, when it's uh. It comes to you know watching out for the big blow, make sure I don't make a mistake. You know, Ray Board. The biggest thing about him that was difficult uh, was not overextending and not giving him a chance to explode mm-hmm. because he would sit there and walk you down and, mm-hmm. blah, 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 and just try to get on you, and that's when he gets the shots. He immediately starts reading you. He starts reading you, yeah. Mm-hmm. So for me, once I saw his, his his video, I was like, oh, that inside nines are all day long. So I started kicking his inside leg, and he starts checking, he starts checking, and then he starts walking through, and then eventually. Things start to add up, add up, and then he got he tries to get your back, and nope. he ended up getting my back, and I got him off my back. So every every fight's difficult. You can't I can't just sit there and pinpoint that one was the hardest. So there's not sure, one sure. that was the easiest, not one. The easiest? I'll probably say Chris Carey also. Really? Yeah. Just because he How was so? he was just a kickboxer, yeah, um, and he was a little bit older, um, yeah. And I was just a young specimen. He was just right. older. <laughs> <laughs> just young and ready to kick ass. Yeah, I was young and ready. And he was and he was almost out. But but credit to him, man. He was on a five fight win streak in the UFC in sure. a flyweight division, which is unheard of. Uh, even to this day, in this mm-hmm. present day, so great guy, uh, like him a lot. Yeah. Um, but I, I felt like you know he he was all about kickboxing, and I felt that his his skill level wasn't he wasn't well rounded. But very tough guy. I mean, five fight win streak. Mm-hmm. I mean, there was a lot of guys who didn't have that. I mean, that's the thing with mixed martial arts. Yeah, you know, people don't get you know. Uh, praise on how many fights they win in a row. They get praise on how, if they can sell a card or they can do this mm-hmm. or whatever. So he he couldn't sell a card, but he was on a five fight win streak. And I was like, dude, this guy deserves a title shot. Like I'm gonna go out there. I took the, the fight absolutely 100 percent seriously, and the training camp was like nine to ten weeks. Um, and then the fight was just easy, and, and that was it. But you, it was still hard in my mind. But since you're digging for a question, uh, answer, I gave you one. Thank you so much. I Have you, are you such a, a ass are, are you <laughs> are you friends with uh, John Bones Jones? Have you yeah, spoken I mean, to him? Uh, I not recently, but um, yeah, we're cool. You know, I, I I when everything went down, I said, man, I hope everything's okay. And yep. Just keep doing your thing, man. I got a personal question. Are you a spiritual man? Do you pray? Uh, every once in a blue moon depends. Why? Do you pray for stuff or do you just say thank you? I say thank you. Like, after I get done swimming in my last training camp, I get up, I bow to the water, and I say, thank you for allowing me to use your... Oh, you think the the stuff that, that helped you? Yeah, I mean, I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I th- I'm i just weird like that. Like, if, if I'm mm-hmm. on the mats or whatever, and when I'm done, when I'm going to go out and do my job, I say, you know, in my mind, I say, thank you for allowing me to, you know, Use you? I sure, sure. Use I'm, I'm you? fucking weird. Yeah, I'm weird. <laughs> I'm thankful for the That's segment. why I'm asking like, the weird like, questions because I sense a little weirdness in there, which I dig. Yeah. yeah. You know, I fuck yeah, with yeah. that. Yeah. I fuck because I think we're all a little weird in here. You know uh, what I mean? Just a little we bit. have to be. We have to be, right? No. Yeah, of but I think you have little little certain things that that make you very interesting. 
Go on. I don't know what it is. I'm not a Go psychic. On. I don't yeah. know. But there's Boston certain things that I'm sure that are in that head of yours yeah. that, you know, that... Yeah, I mean, when it comes to, like, I'll say this probably the one thing I do is that like, I get done swimming yeah. at my training camp. I get up and I bow to one and I was like, I don't know. I just think, you know, with water, it's one of the most amazing things that you can do so much with it. You can swim in it. It's very low impact on your body. So yep. I just take time to turn around and thank it. And I thank my training partners for allowing their bodies to be used as uh, an instrument for me to get ready for my fights. Um, that's so nice. That, that's, you know, I'm, I'm nice about it. I'm not like. No fucking weird, I guess you could say, but no, no, I know, but yeah. weirdo, <laughs> weirdo. This guy, <laughs> yeah, this guy wants to get punched <laughs> so bad. He said weirdo. he would kick your ass two rounds. Yeah, uh, yeah really? he really that, said right. that. No, he really said that before. That. You Didn't you kick him? I did kick him. Yeah. Shit was weak. Oh I know. What I is felt, going on I with him? I felt it was weak. I was sitting there and I kicked him. And I was like. Uh, I should have hit him in the Do you want to kick him again? I no, pissed blood, okay. bro, because of you. Why would you piss blood because <laughs> of that? I'm just kidding. Oh, I thought so. <laughs> oh, I thought so. You had beats that night. That's what you had. You had beats. <laughs> beats. <laughs> I know, right? Yo, congratulations on everything. What is next for you, for, next, for just, you man? Just chilling, man. Um, yeah? I don't plan to get back Family. in the Octagon. Family, Family, obviously. Vacation? Uh, no vacation. No okay. vacation. You know, I got some other things coming. I got TwitchCon this week. Uh, got some on-call casting with uh, Daybreak H1Z1. Sure. And then other than that, man, just chilling. I don't plan on fighting until maybe... February, March. We'll see what's up. Is that right? Or outside, bro. Yeah. Or oh, outside. outside. Or outside hey, of Power hey, 106. Maybe at the flagpole. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. right. Hold me. the flagpole. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, thank you very much for coming through, man. We Thanks, appreciate man. it, man. Appreciate and you're family. welcome. Honestly, you're welcome to I kick Machetto's ass anytime you want. Oh, I already know that. We I appreciate that. you straight up, man. And shout out to Mighty Mouse fans as well. They yes. watch. They love you. You know that. You interact yeah. with them on social media. I yep. saw that. Yep, absolutely, man. Very cool, Thanks, man. Thanks, guys. I appreciate you having me. Dude, we appreciate you, man. Straight up. ass always standing. You got it. Yeah, absolutely. I want those legs Tinderize when I come back. Th thank you. Exactly, <laughs> man. UFC's Mighty Mouse. Let's go. Crew Show. Power 106.